The Top 10 Most Valuable Wine Collections in the World Welcome to Alux.com, the place where future billionaires come to get inspired. If you're not subscribed yet, you're missing out. Hello, Aluxers, and welcome back for a Top 10 countdown that will leave you slightly tipsy as we celebrate 10 of the most expensive wine collections in the U.S. and around the world. As far back as Bacchus and the Bible, wine has been a staple of civilized life. Even though Protestants have questioned the effects of wine and started serving grape juice at communion, the Catholic Church still serves wine in the sacrament. However, there are those who enjoy wine outside of the confines of the church, and they make few apologies for it. Wine in the Western world is made from fermented grapes, and this is the wine we're primarily discussing today. Most wine collections are centered around grape wine because of its historical significance, value, and effect. Some subcultures in the U.S. make wine out of other fruits, and Asians are known to do this as well. For example, the South has watermelon wine, and the Japanese have plum wine. The alcohol content of wine ranges between 5.5 and 15.5 percent. Different reactions between the grapes and the yeast produce subtle differences in the flavors of the wine. This chemical difference determines the character and taste of the wine, and is affected by environmental contexts and farming practices, too. It's a fact that wine was featured greatly in the ancient civilizations of Greece, Thrace, and Rome. Archaeologists have discovered evidence that proves the first winery was situated in Armenia. It dates back 6,100 years. Today, there are those with the means and the desire to collect rare and expensive bottles of wine. A number of factors are involved in assigning a value to a bottle, including quality, age, the number that were produced, the number that are still in existence, and reputation. With all this being said, I think that's enough with the intro, don't you? Let's take a look at the top 10 most valuable wine collections in the world. Number 10. Aubrey McClendon. Value, $8.4 million. The late Aubrey McClendon was a keen wine collector. McClendon earned his money as the CEO of the Chesapeake Energy Corporation, and he definitely put much of his income to use to building this collection. After his passing in 2016, McClendon's extensive wine vault was auctioned off for $8.44 million in Chicago. This was more than the maximum estimate, which was only $7.6 million. Number 9. Robert Rosania. Value? Estimated at $8 million. Real estate developer Robert Rosania has always had a passion for champagne. In 2012, the New York-based collector opted to auction off over 1,000 lots of champagne in Hong Kong. Many of the world's top champagne houses were featured. There was even a Moet & Chandon 1911 champagne on auction, which was estimated to fetch between eight and $12,000. The auction was expected to net sales of $6.3 million. It featured only part of Rosania's collection, and he's continued to acquire more wine over the years. Rosania's love affair with champagne has earned him a great deal of money and will continue to do so as long as he collects. Number 8. Bodega 1860. Value, approximately $13 million. Located in Spain's Basque County, the Bodega 1860 collection is comprised of 129,000 bottles of wine. Although it's housed in the so-called City of Wine of the Marquez de Riscal Winery, the collection is not part of the wine tour and is not accessible to the public. The collection includes bottles of every vintage since it was founded in 1860. Only six bottles remain from the original vintage. A conservative estimate of the value of the wine collection is around $13 million. Number 7. Palais Coburg Wine Cellar. Value, $21 million. This insane collection of over 50,000 bottles is kept at the Palais Coburg, a palace in Vienna, Austria, that today operates as a luxury five-star hotel. The massive collection, which includes some incredibly rare bottles, is kept in six wine cellars. This is the second largest wine collection owned by a private entity in Europe. The Palais Coburg offers special wine tours and customized wine experiences. The entire collection was most recently valued at $21 million. Number 6. The Latour Collection. Value $25 million. The Latour restaurant is found in New Jersey. The restaurant and its astounding collection of wines was established by Jean Mulvihill. 
He passed away in 2012, but his legacy lives on in the popularity of his restaurant. Conservative estimates indicate there's a collection of more than 100,000 bottles of wine in Latour's cellar, valued at $25 million. The wines are stored in two cellars, one at the restaurant with another located at the Crystal Springs Resort. The wine list at the establishment runs into 360 pages, with prices ranging from $50 to $50,000 per bottle. And Aluxers, if you're enjoying this video, you should definitely check out our video, The Top 10 Most Expensive Wines. Just click or tap in the top right corner to check it out. Number 5. Bill Coke. Value $25 million. Bill Koch is one of America's richest men. Having made his money in the energy business, Koch has been collecting wine for a long time. At one point, his collection was estimated to be comprised of 45,000 bottles of wine. And Koch has expensive taste. He favors pricey Burgundy and Bordeaux vintages. In 2016, Sotheby's New York oversaw the auction of 20,000 bottles of fine wines from the billionaire seller, which was less than half of his collection. Koch was quoted as saying he wanted to empty up space in his cellar to continue collecting. The bidding was fierce and the collectors and connoisseurs faced off with each other trying to secure the rare wines on sale. The pre-sale estimates of $15 million were surpassed with a final total being $22 million. This is one of the biggest total sale amounts ever generated by a wine auction. Coke still maintains a large collection of wine, favoring French wines above others. The collection has an estimated total worth of $25 million. Number 4. Greycliff Hotel. Value $25 million. The Greycliff Hotel is tucked away in Nassau in the Bahamas. The incredible wine collection found there is held in the third largest cellar in the world. It's the private collection of the hotel's owner, Enrico Garzaroli. There are over 250,000 selections of wine, including the oldest drinkable wine in the world, a 1727 Rutschheimer Apostel vine that's said to be priceless. The wine list at Greycliff's restaurant is 120 pages long, and you can even claim special seating among the rarest wines in the cellar for a fee of $1,000. Number 3. Burns Steakhouse. Value, over $30 million. Bern Laxer, the founder of Burns Steakhouse in Tampa, Florida, traveled the world collecting a wide range of wines, acquiring one of the largest and most renowned collections worldwide over time. Although Byrne has passed away and the restaurant is now owned by his son David, the wine collection remains one of the most respected and valued in the world. The cellar offers more than 6,800 different selections, with 110,000 bottles kept on the premises and 500,000 more stored in a warehouse across the street. This collection is conservatively estimated to have a value of over $30 million. Number 2. Michel Jacques Chassuel. Value $65.4 million. Michel Jacques Chassuel is one of the world's most savvy wine collectors. Although his collection is not as large as others, it's exceedingly valuable. His collection contains 40,000 bottles of wine. He stores his wine in a cellar in La Chapelle Bateau, and his collection has been valued at $65.4 million. In 2016, he began offering public tastings of his wines. The catch was the ticket would cost around $9,000. In 2017, Chasuel was ambushed at his home by five men who aimed to steal his collection. They held the 75-year-old hostage for two hours, but he refused to hand over the keys to the underground wine bunker that's protected by armored doors. They eventually fled with just eight cases of what he called second-rate wine. They were all later caught and jailed. Number 1. Milesti Michi. Value over $100 million. The Milesti Michi wine collection is actually stored in an underground wine city in Moldova. The cellar complex includes a total of 155 miles of limestone that house almost 2 million bottles of wine. The collection is composed of about 70% red wines, 20% white wines, and 10% dessert wines. This so-called Golden Collection has been certified as the largest wine collection in Europe by the Guinness Book of World Records. The value of this collection comes more from the sheer volume rather than the rarity of the wine. The most expensive bottles stored there are valued around 540 U.S. dollars. 
And there you have it, Aluxers, the top 10 most valuable wine collections in the world. And now a question for you. How do you feel about the fact that some of the rarest and finest wines in the world may never be drank? Let us know in the comments below. And of course, as a thank you for watching with us all the way to the end, Aluxers, you're awesome and we love you. Here's your bonus. European grape species are commonly used as the base of all wines, no matter where they are in the world. These include the Pinot Noir, Chardonnay, Cabernet Sauvignon, Gamay, and Merlot. These are all varieties of the Vitis vinifera, the European grape. Frequently, hybrids of these grapes and others are used to create new wine flavors. The grape species that are native to the Napa Valley of California are seldom used in wine production. Instead, these grapes are favored for the production of jams, jellies, and juices. Thank you for spending some time with us, Aluxer. Make sure to subscribe so you never miss a video. If you want more, we handpicked these videos you might enjoy. Or head over to alux.com for the best in fine living content on the planet. Be a part of the largest community of luxury enthusiasts in the world and tell your story.